Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how I make the bed in our Jayco Penguin. So at the moment we've stripped it. We have washed our Duna cover and our um, fitted sheet and the pillow covers. So I'm just first just going to move the Duna over here. Uh, we currently have a mattress topper on which just makes it an extra bit soft but that's clean. That stays clean because we stick our fitted sheet over the top. Now it can be a bit difficult sometimes making it because you have to climb in. But I'll just show you how I like to do it. Alright, so normally I'll just start in one of these corners. And the best way to do it is, so this is the double bed and we have a double um, fitted sheet, but there's a little bit of room just in the corner that I can fit my foot in and I actually use that to do that. And then I put all my weight on my right foot and lift the side of the bed up. And I find that is the easiest way to get that into that corner and then I put that down and then I'm going to do the exact same over on this corner but I'm going to swap legs sorry I stepped on the clean sheet don't mind it my feet are clean alright so shift my weight onto my left foot and tuck that under like that and that is the top half and yes it does work off a sweat that's the top half and basically I just do the same for the bottom half. I just need to shift the bed a little bit that way. So I'll just move the bed like that so that I have room to get my foot in the other end. Alright, and I'll just get this last corner down. And there we go. That is the fitted sheet. And I'll just fix it up at the front here by tucking it in underneath. And I lift it up here. And I like to just lift this whole thing up because the bed lifts up like this. Just to double check underneath, make sure it's all perfect. And then put that down. It comes down little bit of a wipe off because my feet have been on it and that is the fitted sheet so it's actually not too difficult um I am out of breath it's a bit of it's a bit of an effort but uh, it's not too difficult and um, the more you do it the easier it gets um, and we um, have a normal doona in our um, penguin, I believe this is a queen. Um, so we just use a queen doona, queen doona cover. Basically, just put this on how I, you put on a normal doona cover at your home. So I'll do that now. Someone with <laughs> this sock. Now, this is how I make the bed. I don't think other people do it like this and I don't think my girlfriend appreciates when I stand on the bed. But, I find it's a really good way of shaking out the doona, getting it into all the corners. So I do that. And then I hop over to the end and I do all the buttons up. Now I'll stand at this end just 
so I can stand more on the bed to annoy my girlfriend. Shake it out more. Pop that at the end. Days later. And now Okay. And now I just pop the pillow slips on, which I just popped here. So the theme we have going on in our penguin is um so the outside of the penguin is um, orange and grey, so we thought we'd stick to that theme on the inside. So we have our sort of, yeah, dark grey, beigey grey duna cover, and we basically, anytime we see orange, we buy. We buy anything orange. We have no self-control when it comes to it. We just buy anything orange. So, we were in Bed Bath & Table, and we saw these gorgeous fox prints, and Sally loves foxes, so it was perfect. So we decided to get these pillow slips in the fox print, and they're super cute because you get one side with all the little foxes, and then you get big foxes on the other side. And we also have a blanket with our foxies on it. So normally we'll pop that at the end of the bed on colder nights. Um, we'll put it over the whole bed on warmer nights. Normally we'll just chuck it at the end of the bed because it looks nice like that. Basically, that's how we like to set our bed out. So I sleep on that side. Um, I know some people prefer to not have the beds this way because they find themselves climbing out over people and they don't really like to do that. Um, we decided to pick it this way. We actually don't find it difficult at all. It works really well for us. Um, I have no issue climbing out over the top. It's, it's no drama for us. As I said, some people like it the other way, but personally, um, if you are looking at a penguin and you aren't sure about the beds this way I honestly I think it's I don't I don't see an issue with it it's it's completely personal use but personally yeah I think it's I think it's great all right so that's how we make our bed all right well that is oh I almost forgot our penguin and then we put our little penguin in the middle and that's where he he sits there. Alright, so that is how um, we make the bed. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, stay tuned for more.